Greetings and welcome to Rudy Eats. Today we've got from Little Debbie. This is red velvet Christmas tree cakes. Now I am a fan of the Little Debbie uh, Christmas trees. They're uh, usually white, I believe, but these are specifically branded as red velvet and new. So. Huh, that may be why I've never seen them before. You got uh, Santa kicking back, having a, looks like a cookie and a glass of, uh, maybe he's got a white rush in there, I don't know. And then you've got good old uh, little Debbie with the cold steely gaze of a serial killer. And uh, let's see, anything else? Unwrap a smile this Christmas. That, I don't know, that sounds kind of, Jokerish, I get if you ask me, it's like unwrap a smile this Christmas. Uh, maybe that's just because I have a sick and twisted imagination. Uh, blah blah blah. Nope, no uh, funny little uh, ditty on the back, but you do get to and from tags you can cut out for a holiday uh, project. That's that's not going to keep the kids occupied, uh, just a little note. So, let's see what we got in here. Wow, okay. Now I'm going to apologize in advance, because this, uh, this tree has seen better days. But, this will be uh, like the Charlie Brown tree. Um, it's not exactly perfect, but we love it uh, nonetheless. It's uh, It's different just like everyone else. Um, I love the green sprinkles, like, because that keeps with the pine needle theme. And little red balls on there really do look like Christmas tree ornaments and or uh, holly berries. I guess my number one complaint is why did they pick this shade of olive drab to color the tree in? It looks like pea soup or vomit or it just is the most unappetizing green I've ever seen in my life. Um, but, uh, you know, aside from that, you know, crack it open. And indeed, it is red inside. Uh, has a cocoa hint to it. Um, red velvet does have a chocolate, sort of a cocoa flavor. that. Um, the regular trees uh, generally have more of a vanilla flavor to them, but uh, this does have like a buttery, chocolatey, cocoa-y flavor to the cake, much like a red velvet, which uh, pleases me and surprises me, because usually what cheap people, cheap companies do is they just dump in some red food coloring and bill it as Red velvet, and uh, you know, it sounds all classy, but uh, this is really delicious. It goes really good with the, the cream inside. It's a nice chocolate vanilla contrast in there. Mmm. That is really good. You know, given the choice between the two, the original trees are more attractive just because these, the green on here is just so ugly and it looks kind of like sick with the red. And uh, kind of looks like you're you're ripping open its insides, and that's like the meaty flesh. But uh, flavor wise, I like that. Mm, there's a nice richness to it that uh, I didn't expect. Some nice depth. Yeah, a glass of milk would be a real winner with those. Mm, I'm gonna get me some when I get when I get up and leave you. But uh, yeah. Uh, Little Debbie Red Velvet Christmas Tree Cakes. Uh, where did I pick these up? I don't think it was Big Lots. Um, I'm going to say uh, Target. I should really keep better notes on this kind of stuff. But there you go. They're delicious. They are new. I don't know if they're limited edition. Um... 
you might never have another opportunity to taste a red velvet Christmas tree cake if you let this slip by and then you'll have to go to your grave knowing that you've lived your entire life without red velvet Christmas tree cakes.